hello my youtube family you're here with skipper drones and today i am bringing you in the ditzy coon 5.5 inch this is the one i built and now it's time for the resurrection i'm using the ion 2205 2500 kv motors on this So this is going to be very nice and I am going a different way. I had the dial RC, no, I take that back. I'm sorry. I had the speed X, uh, 35 amp four and one ESC in here with the CL racing F four flight controller. This time I'm going a little different. I have the, Dial RC F405 AIO flight controller. All in one flight controller. So this is what I'm putting in there now. This is gonna be a nice build here. Nice build. Yes, that's what I'm putting in the F405 AIO flight controller. I have these here. To go in it. I ordered some XT60 connectors. <clears throat> I have here. This is the Foxier Arrow. Pro. So this is what I'm putting. This is the camera I'm putting in it. The Fox Zero Arrow Pro. Yeah, as you know, I deal with a lot of Fox Zero. I mean, I believe that's the only camera I've been ordered was the Fox Zero cameras. So that's the Arrow Pro. That's what I'm putting in there. Uh, let's see. These here. Got a XM Plus receiver, <clears throat> and I'm gonna put these these in the Ditsy Slims 40 amp uh, ESCs. Run up to two to four S. Yes, and these are the Slims, you know, the Ditsy Slims. So they're supposed to fit on these Slim arms. This is an ultra light frame. I just wanted to take a look for a minute. Oh yeah. Wow. That's gonna be close. Oh yeah, we can make it happen. So these are the Dizzy Slims. Put it on 5.5 inch. So yes, this here is the Naditsi 5.5 inch coon. I kind of like Naditsi frames. <clears throat> they are solid, nice carbon. And they fly good. I mean I don't know a lot yet about FPV. What I do know is they fly pretty good. Solid. <clears throat> uh, this is the Nadizzi, uh Coon I built. I got the Nadizzi family. That's the Coon. This is a beast. This has the uh, Brother Hobby 2207s, 2700s, KV. 
But these are the brother hobbies here. I don't know if you can see them, but yes, these are nice. And I got the Fox here Predator camera in this. Yeah, this is a beast here. I got the Wolf Whoop VTX. And this is a Dow RC um, F405 with the Dow RC engine 40 amp ESC, all 4 in 1 ESC in this one. Yeah, she's a beast. Let me sit her over here. And this is the AX215 uh, with the six millimeter arms and the Dissy. This has got the uh, Fox Air Predator camera. This has got the Xing um, iFlight motors. 2203, I mean 2206, 2750 KV. This is a nice one too. This has the Adelada VTX, the uh, Kulte uh, V2 flight controller, and the Kulte uh, ESCs, 401 ESCs. So yeah. They all fly beautifully. I'm just waiting to get a little better. Plus, I work a lot, so which is not an excuse, but that that stops me from flying a lot. But I got to get more practice in and, and get it together. But I do enjoy building, as you can see. So yes, this is gonna this one here is gonna have the Dow RC um 405 AIO. Okay you guys. We're gonna start off with the Dow RC F405 I AIO flight controller. Alright, this is the flight controller here you guys. Like I said, I don't have a camera to zoom in. I apologize. So I am about to the, the, uh, solder everything down on here and get it together. Get the flight controller ready for the wiring. I think I'm gonna start. I'm gonna do my camera wire and VTX while it's out the quad. The way the quad is built. So yes, this is the. Uh, Flight control, all in one flight controller. Here, you guys. We have the power for the ESCs. We have the, uh, the power for the battery. It has E1 here. And that's for the uh, current sensing. And we also, on this side, it's hard to see, but. <clears throat> it's hard with this camera you guys I apologize but this is the ground positive and camera uh, wire in the VTX and this flight controller here also has a it's, it's set for 9 volt but you can bridge these two together that's 9 volt or you can take that off and bridge these two sides and you get 5 volt so it also have an option for 5 volt or 9 volt so that's good also alright you guys I'm about to t tune this up and um, I'll be back ok you guys back here I got everything soldered down I got my power wire soldered in, VTX wire, I got my ground, I got the hot, I got the v VTX wire, and then I got this going to TX5, smart audio. This is my camera, I got the ground, I got the uh, 9 volts going in, and I 
have the camera wire is yellow. So that's soldered it up. So I have to solder my uh, the next thing I'm gonna solder is uh, my motor wires, my ESC wires, and the receiver. Yes, the solder is getting better. Nice brown joints, shiny. It's getting a look better, you guys. So I'm about to solder the motor wires and figure that out with the ESCs here. These are the ESCs, the DITC 40 amp ESCs here. <clears throat> so yes, these are gonna be nice. So I'm about to see here. I had to take the motors off for a minute, but I got to link the wires to see what's going on here. It's gonna be pretty nice. So I'm about to figure this out, you guys, and I'll be back. All right, now here she go. Turned out to be a nice build here. We have the Ion. 2205 2500 kV motors. We had an Aditzi 40 amp slim uh, ESCs. We had a Wolf Whoop VTX and we had a uh, FR Sky XRSX receiver and we have the Dow RC. F405 AIO VTX. So it turned out to be a pretty nice, simple build. Oh, yeah, we have the Naditsi Foxeer Predator uh, micro camera. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Let me see if I have. What did it do? We have the Naditsi stuff. Uh, antenna here for the back so yes this is gonna be a, this is turned out to be an awesome build you guys <coughs> uh, battery I want you guys to see how clear this camera man this camera is yes that is always a good sound, you guys. Always a good sound. Give it one second here. Mm, I guess it's dead. I have to charge my goggles up to show you guys the screen, but I was watching it last night and it it had a good picture. So now what's left of me to put everything together and to uh, put, it here. put everything together here and and uh, going to beta flight. I don't know yet if I have to change the direction of my motors yet, but I won't know that till I go into beta flight and test and uh and set up everything in beta flight so okay here she go you guys the ditzy 5.5 inch coon pretty nice pretty nice all right here she go fully assembled nice fully assembled you guys nice all right, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. That helps my channel out a lot if you haven't subscribed because there's a lot more good content coming. And don't forget to hit that like button and leave me a comment below. All right, it's Skipper Drones, and I'm out.